Hey all, it's Sonny. Okay, so I just did the other video with uh, Beth's super tip, and I'm going to kind of just follow up on that. So, what you can get from the merchant, I'm about to collect from him now, and this is a lot of supplies you can use on that festival island. So, um, I'm going to click him. Here we go. So 40 bay leaf, 20 saffron, and 25 pink pepper. All right, so I'm going to click him again. So this is like beige, green, and blue. Well, the higher points are coming from blue, so I'm just going to use that. And you can see the points coming. All right, and that is three hours. For that so you can get like the rare spices from this merchant instead of clearing on the island okay the island map though if you do not want to clear the entire island um, the biggest thing that I have had trouble with working this festival pomegranates which are the ones in red pomegranates and hibiscus, which is in the pink. So, I mean, you could come up, get in there and get one pomegranate, come around this way, grab, you know, to the left and grab a couple of hibiscus and then get up here to the top on the second pomegranate. And then you would have some extra hibiscus and some extra pomegranate. Also, the ones in white are the extra kitchens. So if you can get to one or two extra kitchens, that would be really helpful. You wouldn't have to open the entire island. All right, on your way. Um, if you're opening the entire island, here's where all the gifts are. If you only want to come around to, these, to this left side, or even if you want to go around to the right side, maybe you don't want to go to the left, maybe you want to go to the right, fine. Here's where all the gifts are at. These gifts contain... Uh, all the spices you need for making the tea. They also have a lot of hibiscus in them. Um, I didn't see any pomegranate in there, you know, or vanilla, but I was running out of hibiscus, and there were hibiscus in these gifts, so it was worth it for me to grab these if I could. Um, so, anyway, there they are. It's not all of them. I think that's like, oh, that's 72. Okay my cricket scratch the cricket um 72 out of the 80 gifts there depending on whichever way you want to go if you can get the gift get it because it's going to give you extra supplies that you need for cooking okay so the theory is the best theory um if you work this large table three times a day for the duration of the festival then you can get that pet that way without getting into a comp or anything else or doing anything else so um i don't think it'll be the entire you know 20 days because of the quests that are up here like i said these quests will give you blue coins um but this let me show you this is what it wants it wants four four and four so those are in this here so four of these three times a day right there and then once you click it and set the table then you've got the three judges there there they are so and what they want is tea so you're you're going to have an option let me just do her first here's your option i've been doing this one so It'll take five to get her up into green. So I just always pick that blue option. And I do, and you've got 15 minutes to get them up to green. And, you know, as you can see, it's only one minute between. So it takes five minutes to get them to green. And you need to have the five things prepared so the five things are in here it's this white one and then these two 
and you can see what they need and you can get this from your merchant which I just showed you the merchant you also need vanilla so you're gonna have to get that here off your island and then fruits from your and milk from your own island the vanilla this grows back but um, there are also other areas in here where there is vanilla you could just use your eye for that all right she's ready now we're getting into blue there we go all right so we've got 13 minutes left I'll just pause for a sec all right we're about to do what's her name I can never remember her name um, Ashley so note my coins down here 194 because what's going to happen is doing this table I should get 12 coins and the theory is if you do three times a day it's 12 times three and I'm not doing the math I hate math you guys all know that so that was the third one so the theory is if you do this table three times a day Getting them up to green, which we still have two more to do, but we've got 12 minutes to do it three times a day, then you should be able to get enough coins to acquire that pet. And some people were, or, or Beth said that it would be every day for the entire duration of the festival, but, but I don't think so because of this. I think you're going to, as you go, you're going to pick up coins. So that'll boost up. Um, 15 seconds don't forget to just keep on your vanilla this is the one I've had a hard time with vanilla and I've had a hard time with hibiscus and you want um, pomegranate trees you know and do this too because you need strength to do the pomegranate so um, it's work okay that was four we're on the fourth one four And four. So one more. These should hit green. And it's nice because once they hit green, unlike in, uh, I like it, Plant Kingdom or some other things where the green ticks down, once you get it up there, it, it seems to just stay. I have not had any problem just with the fifth feeding, keeping it on green and uh, getting a gold key every time so if you, if you don't get it to gold you're gonna get the uh, silver right here and that's not gonna be as many of these t uh, master tokens and the whole point is to get the max of these coins that you can get by feeding this table which is the reason you want to get this up there we go, all the way full to green. Okay, let's get him to green. And we'll get her to green. All right, and then we are just gonna wait. And it's just waiting out the 10 minute timer or whatever the timer is once you get them up to green and they will give you a gold coin if they are in green at the end of that 10 minutes. All right, I, what I didn't mention was the timer on this table. Um, this says three hours and 14 minutes. I think when we started, it was a little higher than that. So three and a half hours-ish. In my other video, I said four hours. So it's actually more, it's actually closer to three and a half hours. Um, three and a half hours, three times a day. What is that, 10 hours or whatever? I mean... You have to try and figure that out if you want that pet and get get your times down and get your math down as far as what you need to cook in here and in here. Now you can use, let me click on Rachel. There are these other teas you can use. Um, I'm not using them because just for tonight I'm, I'm putting all that on my uh, other tea tables, but you can do that. I mean, if you have those other things instead if you have a lot of this and you don't have a lot of that then you know make the other one but 
these are special, these three, requiring the spices from um, the merchant. Um, but these two require stuff like this hibiscus from the island. Well, these require spices too, so never mind that. Um, you know, but if these are easier for you, then make that tea. You know, you might just have to make more of it to get where you're going. The higher points are, are the one that is colored here, blue. So blue's going to get this bar closed quicker than if you're using these other two teas. All right, you can see we are at three minutes counting down. The timer is still fully on green, so you don't really have to watch that. Thankfully, they gave us that. And we are waiting for three more minutes. All right, timer's running out. One is done. Two done. And Rachel, tag them behind. All right, so if we click on this, we get the gold key, golden key. She disappears, click on him, get the key. He disappears, click on her. So it has to be the gold key, um, otherwise the points are not gonna be as high. But for this, it should be 12 points. And again, note the number down here, 194. Theory being, three times a day at this table will get you to the number you need for that pet. So this should be 12. <clears throat> and getting 12 three times a day should be enough. I'm not doing the math. You guys do the math. And I'm at 206. So that's the theory. Um, that's what I'm doing from this point once I get through this night. So it's not going to be easy. Not going to be easy. You're going to have to come over. You're going to have to collect the vanilla. You're going to have to collect, you know, fight these sundews and get the mandarin. You're going to have to come get the pomegranates and the hibiscus. Like I said, I ran out of hibiscus and pomegranates more than anything else and use your merchant for supplies unless you plan on clearing this entire island. Um, if you do, okay, here's where the pomegranate and hibiscus are. Here are all the gifts that hold all kind of stuff, including hibiscus. So um, if you want to give it a shot, give it a shot. Um, I just wanted to give that little bit of additional information and all right, you guys, I seriously am about to chill out for the entirety of the rest of the weekend. So have a great weekend. Um, don't forget to like and share and follow my channel. And I will talk to you soon. Thanks so much. Bye.